We are learning disturbing information about an investigation at Knollwood Memorial Park in Canton. The state says during an inspection last week, it discovered the remains of 300 fetuses and infants stored in leaky plastic containers at the cemetery. The cemetery's license has been suspended while the investigation goes on. Most of the remains found came from Perry Funeral Home in Detroit. Their license was suspended weeks ago. A huge crowd tonight at Little Caesars Arena for Michelle Obama's book tour. Becoming has sold nearly 3 million copies this year, now the best-selling book of 2018. Tonight's event was part of her stadium tour, which is billed as an intimate conversation with the former first lady, who discussed her journey and told the younger generations it's okay to struggle. I want young kids to understand that that's what makes them special. It's that struggle. It's that climb. It's the journey to become. It's not when you arrive at something and that's the end. It's that whole journey and you should own it with pride. Be proud of it. Put it out there. The book tour has become so successful. Today it was announced the tour has added 21 new dates across North America and Europe. Postal workers are in overdrive getting ready for the busiest time of the year. This is the Michigan Metroplex mail processing plant in Pontiac working around the clock right now to handle this Christmas rush. It's expected the U.S. Postal Service will ship 16 billion cards, letters and packages this holiday season and at least 2 billion of that will be sent out just the week before Christmas.